He's got a diamond draw and a gut shot. Oh, diamond. Oh. Okay. It is week two, vlog number two. And I'm just about to fire up some online tournaments. Okay, uh, so we're about two hours into the session so far and uh, yeah, things are not really going according to plan. I just had second best hands pretty much every time and uh, yeah, busted a few, re-entered a few. There's nothing I could have done differently, I don't think. Quick break, then back on it. Aces. Button raises, we're gonna be three betting. We make it a cool 700. Okay, we might make it a little bit more now. Might make it 800 to go. Mm, okay, squeezed with the aces. And we get one fold. He's thinking. And he calls. So we have two X pot behind. Um, can't really see how we. Um, don't get lots of chips in here. I guess if the turn is like the six, if the turn is the six of clubs or something, then maybe we don't. I'm gonna bet small, maybe induce a shove. <laughs> the six of clubs. <laughs> We just check. I mean, we can't value that. <laughs> and he has ace queen of clubs, and I mean. <laughs> um, okay. And we did it! Yeah. We min cashed a $22 bowl. Okay, so in an interesting turn of events, we are now the chip leader with 38 remaining. We've gone a little bit crazy. If I have an option to raise or bet, that's what I've done for the last 30 minutes. And I've gone from, I think, around 200k to almost 900k. I'm going to see if that can continue in the next hour. If it does, we probably win this tournament. Okay, a uh, quick update then. Um, we are one of 13. Uh, we have 3.8 million and uh, yeah, things are going well. We are uh, one of nine. Okay, we are... One of six, we are one of five. So we are now uh, three of four, lost a couple of uh, medium sized pots and we've now gone uh, heads up on both tables. Okay, we have made the final table. We are three of three. Okay, uh, so we just played this hand, we defended with Jack nine. Uh, he bets pretty big. Uh, this guy has a massive sizing tail, so when he bets like 30 to 40 percent pot he's betting for value uh this is uh this is a bluff um i call i think you can just get it in on the flop to be honest with our stack size he then bets half pot so before with uh, value he was just betting small and i think he'd do that again here so i decide to jam and uh he calls he's got jack six of clubs so uh we chop if a 10 comes but we're doing pretty well i uh, just got to fade the clubs really and club on the river so we're going to bust in third. Another bronze medal. Um, I don't want to make a habit of finishing third all the time. I mean, a podium finish is great, but third place finishes, not as good as first, are they? Okay, it is Wednesday evening and just about to give Trisha a call to record uh, another episode of Poker on the Mind. So, uh, how you doing? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm doing well. It's still really warm, but yeah, I've been working on a bit of the book today. Yeah, so I was just doing follow-ups to that, really, and doing my own research. I mean, if I show you my notes, maybe we do the podcast and then I'll show you my notes. Right then, should we go straight in? Hello and welcome to episode 47 of Poker on the Mind, the podcast dedicated to answering your questions on both tournament poker strategy and peak poker performance. Now here are your hosts, Gareth James, and Dr. Trisha Cardner. Hey guys, how's it going? Um, Trisha, how are you? Okay, so on Saturday, uh, so we're now on Thursday, so what, five days ago, 
I decided that I wasn't going to eat meat for a week and uh, just because, uh, not for any reason, not because I worry about animals being killed. I just thought, let's just have a vegetarian diet. So I was in the supermarket earlier and I was just uh, picking some things off the shelf and this lady said, that, uh, as I picked up these classic uh, corn burgers, look at those bad boys. She said that they're absolutely lovely, especially with some fried onions. Uh, so, bought an onion as well. Gonna have these tonight. Pretty excited to try some classic corn burgers. To be honest, they look like normal burgers. Um, I doubt they taste like burgers, but who knows. Uh, yeah, so that'll be fun tonight. Uh, also, for lunch now, I've got these. Cheating, a delicious meat-free alternative. Basically, bacon. But I mean, look at it. Kind of looks like bacon, but yeah. Uh, we'll see, I'm gonna have those for lunch now. So have those with some egg and some baked beans and some toast. So I know it doesn't look that appealing. I've never really been one for making it look really nice on the plate, but we're gonna try the bacon. Wish me luck. Okay, I'm just gonna try it without the beans. I mean, it's not bacon, but it's not bad. I mean, it's edible and yeah. All right guys, it's raining, which I think is gonna cool everything off. So we won't be so hot anymore. And I might actually put a t-shirt on. I've got a vest on at the moment. Um, it's not one of my best, but it's just so hot. And really, I just wanna walk around with no top on, but you guys told me off last week for not having a top on. So I've got a top on when I'm film and uh, yeah, hopefully this will now cool things off. I can put a proper top on for later on. For now, it's time for the online grind. If there was ever a time to um, hit the Royal, this is it. Wow, we got 45.6% equity and 100% equity. Let's go. We're gonna be all in with the Ace 10 off. Okay, we're gonna call with the Ace King suited. Um, I'm actually just gonna get it in with the nines because we cover both of these players and it's a bounty. Uh, we've got Aces here. We've got Ace King over here. Here with the tens, we're just gonna call. Ace King here with Ace 10, we're just gonna shove. And wow, he folded. Okay, and we won the tens against Ace King in the big 55. Okay, we are in the money in the hot 109. We've locked up $203, almost 7K up top. Let's get it. Okay, we're all in with Ace 8 offsuit under the gun here, seven handed. Uh, we're 42 of 45. Uh, we've been isolated by Persegno, so. Uh, okay, sweat it with me, guys. See if we can beat Persegno. Oh, we've been called. Oh, we've got the best hand. We have the best hand. We need to get there. We don't. Say la vie. And we bust in 44th place for. $238.70. Okay, we are in the money, 44 of 45 in the 50 Euro Championship. We have eight big blinds, which, which is plenty. Yes, we're 44 of 45, but eight big blinds is loads. Nine of 17, we're 10 of 11. Okay, so we're on the final table of the 50 Euro uh, Championship on iPoker. And just like that, we've uh, lost a player. Just as we say that, we have ace queen offsuit here and we're probably gonna be getting it in. We don't really wanna bust before the big blind and the guy next to us here, but we're playing to win. I mean, the pay jumps up right now, uh, so there's seven left. So we've locked up 323 euros. Might do some stand-up hype now. We still got the t-shirt on. Stand-up hype with the ace queen off. We're all in. We've been called by eight, it's a flip. Can we win the flip? 
Get there. Ace, queen, ace, queen. Ooh, we are out in seventh. All right, guys, I'm just about to go and get my hair cut. So I'll see you very, very soon. And we're back. Okay, so just got the haircut, fresh trim. Uh, also got the beard trimmed because I know that some of you were uh, suggesting maybe the beard could do with some work as well. So got that sorted and I am all ready for Romania. So just got the weekend of online grinding and then we're flying out to Bucharest. Okay guys, look, it is just ridiculously hot. There's no way I'm putting a t-shirt on. You're just going to have to deal with it. Uh, in other news, we are on the final table of the tea time on iPoker. We are currently uh, two of six. Okay, we are down to five in this six max comp. Okay, and just like that, we are down to four. We are still one of three uh, as it's the break. And I'm going to go and put a t-shirt on because you don't want to be looking at this for the rest of the vlog. Okay, guys, we found a t-shirt and we also are now heads up in this tournament. We've got the chip lead, we've got almost a million chips, got 600k. Okay, we're gonna be all in here. We're gonna be jam with the ace three off. Oh, and he's been called, we've been called by Queen Jack off. He's hit a queen, we need an ace or a three dealer. Ace or a three dealer. Not today, guys, gonna be a second place. <laughs> Hi guys, uh, so it's Sunday and uh, we've got three tournaments left. We built some stacks and then we lost some stacks. And uh, yeah, that's uh, Sundays. Let's see what happens. Let's get it. Okay, things are getting interesting. Uh, we are four of 14 now in the Phoenix and we are 13 of 23 in the Super Sunday Deep Stack. Right, we are on the final table bubble. We're five of 10 in the 20 euro rebuy Phoenix. Okay guys, interesting hand uh, to burst the bubble. Three way all in, uh, it was Queen Jack versus Kings versus Ace Queen and Ace on the flop, uh, two players were eliminated. So we are eight left, we are six of eight. Okay guys, we open the aces off about 20 bigs. Pretty much got the same size stack as this guy right now. Okay, well, <laughs> this is it. Hopefully he doesn't have a four. He's got a diamond draw and a gut shot. Oh, diamond. Oh. Right guys, that's a wrap for week two. Hope you enjoyed it. If you want to continue to see what life is like as a professional poker player and get a behind the scenes look at the lifestyle, the strategy, the study habits and everything else, then make sure you hit subscribe right now. Do it now, hit subscribe. Next stop, Bucharest. And until then, let's get it. See ya.